in my previous video i talked about how to fade image with background and i got a comment that what of using the drawing tool this per the person is referring to this drawing tool so this drawing tool here that how can we use it to fade or blur image in pixel lab so i'm going to show you how to fade images or blur images with your background using this draw this exact draw tool that we have here so follow me closely as i give you the tips and how to do it that it will blend together with the background and it will fit with the background so let's start a new project so if you want to create a faded image let's start a new project using our uh, image size of youtube thumbnail size now you have your canvas already on your pixel lab established or set you've set the size of the design you want to create let's say you want to create a conference design and you need to blend your image with the background of the ministers or any other thing so let's bring in the background first by taking it from our gallery so this is the the background i used for that one i'll teach you how to use the draw tool to make your image fade with the background easily and how to make that background appear as if it is still the background so once you bring in the background like this you need to bring in your images that you want to fade with the background so let's quickly do that let me quickly give you one tip if you want to import multiple images just tap your import three times it will enable you to pick the three images and then you can you can continue with your design can you see so you can bring in multiple images like this first of all adjust and create your image import the last one So after placing all your images, let's take these two back. We want this one to stand at the middle. So once you place your image rightly, make sure it is right. The sizes are okay. So for this last one you create the size also okay this one is not lying well so you can leave it that way now that you've import your images into pixel lab you need to go to your draw tool this is your draw tool here how do you use your draw tool to blur image into pixel lab select the draw tool but you are not done with selecting you can't go straight away and start giving your your photos rubbish no clear off that and start by picking the color so you click this plus button here after clicking that plus button it will display the color palette or color option that you have in pixel app so you need to click this one there is one eyedropper tool at the top here once you click that eyedropper tool to pick the color, pick the color from the background straight away. Just put it on any part that picks the color you want, then activate it. But it is not done. You are not done with that also. You need to adjust this one, move it from here to somewhere around here to create a fade, a faded color of that kind of color. So once you move it like this to the part where you want it to be, you click on OK. After clicking on OK, scroll. Don't do it yet. Scroll upward. You will see blur radius at the base. Increase the blur radius to 25. Depends size also. You can increase it to 50 or 55, depending on how large you want it to be. Now, after doing that, start fading your image. Can you see? The part you want, want that image to fade. 
So as I'm using my finger now, it will be creating the fades. So it will fade the image. I don't do it too much at one point or else it will be too faded and it won't give you the result you want. So fade it, fade it like that, depending on how you want it to go. Now, you see that I've accomplished this, but it has affected my background. So this is what I will do. I will take this place after adjusting that and I've done all my blur fade as I want it to be. I've fed the images. So I will click the option that I'm done. You see what it gave me. So if you place it at the base of your pictures, it will be faded. All the images will fade. But I want it to look professional and also give it a spice. So now I'll go to texture. Here is texture in Pixel Lab. Once you click on texture, you'll be able to pick the image you want to add. So you pick the background again. This is the background. Then you move it to where that lower part that you fit is. It is somewhere around here. Then you tick it. Can you see what it gave us? So if you place it, it will look as if the image is fading and it is still the background. But it is not done. Click on texture again and adjust the size of that until it, it is, an, is exactly the stuff is exactly on that if you notice the black part there is one part that is touches from up to down so you adjust it until it is already on it perfectly or somewhere close this is 145 percent then i can move it to the left a bit or right a bit to match that exact part so that is how to use your draw tool your draw tool here to create faded images so please subscribe to this youtube channel and like this video drop a comment for me and i'll be happy to give you the videos you are expecting